Hi, this is Ryan from RapidWeaverClassroom.com, and I'd like to introduce you to the Switcher Stack from Stack Maniac. The Switcher Stack is a highly customizable and versatile stack that allows you to add content to your page using an accordion or a tabbed content area. In this demonstration, we can see the accordion style. We have three different sections of content that are broken up in this accordion, and you can see that presented here. Now the switcher stack is responsive and there are endless possibilities because you can embed switcher stacks inside of other switcher stacks. So you can have combinations of accordions inside of tabbed content or tabbed content inside of accordions or any combination of that. Let's jump into the edit view and take a look at how we set this up. This is the switcher stack as it is collapsed on the page and it's nice that you can do that because it frees up space in the edit view. If you need to customize the content, you can simply uncheck the collapse option and that will reveal all of the content there inside of the switcher stack. The first thing that we want to do under setup is choose the type. At the moment, we're looking at the accordion type. We'll stay there for a moment and take a look at those options. The first thing we need to do is define the amount of content that we're going to be using inside of switcher. And by default, you have three items. You can go all the way up to 30 items of content. You're simply going to drag and drop any kind of stacks inside the content spaces here. You can see, first of all, I have a text stack, two columns, and then five columns in these three content spaces. Next, we'll look at the style options, which include font size, border radius, and if we come down into this section of the controls, we have different themes to choose from. We can also define the title color, the background color, and the border color using the color pickers. If you don't want a border, you can simply uncheck the border option to toggle that off. If you want to see some more examples of the themes available with Switcher, make sure and check out the demo here at stackmaniac.com. Let's jump back up to the type and now select the tabs. We're going to look at the options here in a moment, but first let's take a look at what this looks like in the preview mode. So as you can see with just a flip of an option, you can now have a completely different layout using Switcher in the tabbed content view. There are plenty of options available for this view as well. And so we can see the number of items once again that we want to add to the content space. And then we can define the height and the width of the tabs. Next is an option for tabs to accordion. This is quite nice because it allows you to switch from tabs to an accordion style when you have a smaller screen for viewing, such as a mobile device. Next, there's an option for a fade transition for the tabs that can be used, and that is optional. And then we have some other style options, font size, border radius, and then once again, we have our themes and our colors for title, background, border, and the option to toggle off the borders. So as you can see, the switcher stack is very flexible in how it will allow you to present the content on your site using either a tabbed or accordion style. And that is the switcher stack from Stack Maniac.